Final round of the year, of course, the four-wheel drive series is up for grabs. They've been leading it most of the year. Third this weekend, second for the season. That close, but you must be still very pleased, me. Oh, stoked, yeah. Look, we sat down at the end of last year and they'd, uh, you know, had a chat about what we wanted to try and achieve again, and that was uh, finishing every stage that we went into every rally. Uh, I think we've completed in uh, 92 stages this year and finished every one of them. Uh, we're super stoked with that, and realistically, coming from a, a horror year last year and to what we've achieved this year, the big thing for me that I've got a lot out of is actually the speed. Um, our seating list is, uh, you know, on the seating list we're sixth or something now, which is, you know, I think at the end of last year we were 64th or something like that. So, um, you know, that, that's really pleasing, and, and we can only go up and get better from there, basically. So. Bernie, it's the, the, the rules this year, of course, you know, three rounds count. You guys have done the whole season. It's been fabulous to have you there. So it must be a bit of a bit of pill to swallow, but like Mick said, the speed, you would you always reinvented yourselves this year. Absolutely. Look, Mick's really stepped up this year. He's learned a lot. He's moved on. We've got a great team behind us. The guys at Race Talk have turned out a brilliant car. But uh, as you know from your own career, it's all well and good to have a good car. But if you if you don't steer it well, you still go nowhere. So Mick's done a great job, yeah. stepped up, put it all on the line a few times. Yeah. And I think uh, we've put one one little mark on the car, which was today <laughs> on a super special where they've added a new barrier. Well, so, it might have been a couple of marks. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> oh, come on, it's a good story. Yeah, it's yeah, a good yeah, story. Yeah. He's, yeah. he's done a great job. But with it's, and I think podium every round and stuff. Yes. So the consistency's there, and it's not just that, it's the speed as well. So like I said, I think you'd be buoyed from this time last year to now. Amazing transformation. I mean, I hope you're back next year mate. Oh massively and, and that's the thing two firsts, uh, two seconds and a third so yeah damn happy with that so five trophies nothing wrong with that. Second for the weekend and how good is this a debut heat win congratulations Harry Bates, John McCarthy well done mate awesome weekend you must be absolutely stoked. Thank you yeah no it's been an amazing weekend we came in wanting to learn as much as we could and um, you know I think we've the results just a bonus I suppose but yeah a great day today in particular. John, you've been given the task of uh, guiding this guy through, you know, the front wheel drive and had some great results early in the season. Then, pretty big step up for you guys and to get, get the whole of this car for the weekend. Yeah, I, and I, maybe it's not lost on Harry, but it was pretty fortunate for us to get an upgraded car for this weekend as well. And uh, it's paid off, you know, we, we got the result, which is great news. It's good. What's it like in the car with him? Uh, it's, look, it's most of the time really, really good. Um, he achieves his speed the right way, not the wrong way. And, it only gets messy every now and then. <laughs> we don't tell Dad that one, of course, Harry. Um, what happens, you're under a lot of pressure. You know, you've got the base name, you've got a championship winning car, all eyes are on you. Um, is it sort of weight off the shoulders to get here right now at the weekend and finish the season on a great high like this? Yeah, and on top of that, we wanted to finish. It was always something we we're going to treat as a test event. So, you know, on top of all that pressure, I suppose, the other side of it was trying to get to the finish the whole time. And, um, yeah, to be here and to have a good result is, is all yeah. pretty good news. The winners of this round, and more importantly, the four-wheel drive series champs, Marcus and Scott Walkham. You put it all together. Congratulations. Yeah, no, it's, um, we knew we had a, a big job to do this weekend, but just kept chipping away from the power stage and then through each heat and um, managed to come away with the win. So, um, yeah, just absolutely over the moon at the moment. Scott, the, the pressure was on you guys because you had to tick a lot of boxes. I kept saying it to you all weekend, you had to win, you did the power stage, put it all together, it was all yours for the taking and you've, you've come through with the gold. Yeah, no, that's correct. We had to break the problem down into components and just step by step, starting from the power stage, heap one win on day one, really put us in a good position to attack on day two and then finish it off today. So You're good. pretty quietly spoken, Marcus. And I, I, did, Were you hunting the championship or just the rally? You've got great support from your family and your crew. Tell us how you're feeling right now. Oh, look, yeah, over the moon. Just um, we, we knew we were outside chance for the championship, but, um, you know, it just had to put it all together and, and have managed to do so. So just really happy for the team and mum and dad and Scott. Yeah, so...